A very good morning, Sakina. You're correct. For the first time in my career, in a while uh, though, I found myself having to dig really deep deep because science is such a broad conversation and you want to really hone in uh, on what the important aspects are. As you say, uh, this is something the continent hasn't seen before, uh, a project that was launched by the former Minister of Science and Technology, who's now the Minister of International Relations, uh, Dr. Naledi Pando, coming to fruition, bringing this conference to South Africa, of course now under the leadership uh, in the Department of Science and innovation of Dr. Blade Nzemande. Uh, the e actual event will be hosted at the Cape Town ICC uh, from the 6th to the 9th of December. Uh, today's event is merely a launch of the conversations uh, that are supposed to take place leading up to that uh, conversation, uh, bigger conversation in December. Uh, it's under the auspices of the United Nations Education, Scientific and Culture organization uh, UNESCO they've released a report uh, that uh, speaks to or uh, speaks to, or flags rather uh, the funding shortages uh, in this space globally and highlights the countries that are leading in this aspect China is one of those and it also flags uh, the uh, just the uh, non-existence of women scientists in leading conversations in the science space, whereas women are contributing so much uh, to innovation and science, um, but also just mostly just want to bring home, uh, just make scientific conversations uh, relatable and relevant to our everyday lives. And this is what it will aim to do.